Hello, my name is Ramzona, and today I will give you some actual tips and hacks regarding dredge. I gathered some things I haven't seen others do yet, so without further ado, let's start with the first tip. You can use some abilities at the same time, like here I'm using the net and then haste. Of course, you have to first lower down the net in order to be able to use it. If you are lost and can't find your way home, then you can always search for the lighthouse, which you can see from every main location in the game. So, if you are an achievement hunter like me and want to gather all the achievements, I suggest that you do two things from the start. Always have a net equipped so you can gather fishes for the tangled in this web achievement, uh, same goes with the trapped in this walls achievement. Always have some crab pots equipped, that way you can also have endless money source. Once you go to the gale cliffs and do the missions there, you get some explosives which are very handy when you need to open faster routes like in Twisted Strand, which is a very annoying map to navigate. I hate this part of the game, honestly. If you see blue floating things over the fishes, that means that there is a chance to get an apparition fish. If you aren't happy with your current progress in the day, or you simply wish to restart the day, there are two ways. Either cross your boat and continue from the last save point, or just quit to the menu and continue. The point is that you haven't saved your game yet by going to a new dock. Uh, going to a new dock always saves your game. You need parts in order to upgrade your boat, you can find parts near shallow areas or broken ships. Occasionally you can find research parts as well from these. They usually respawn at some point, so visit other islands in the meantime. If you're in a hurry, especially during the night time, don't worry about crashing into the docks and traveling merchant. You cannot get damage from those. Same goes with the floating lights on the water. This has been also mentioned in other tips videos, but I also wanted to include it in mine, because I wish I also remembered this fact earlier in the game, that you can use the telescope, or spyglass as they call it, to look for fishes, because I literally spent half of the game looking for certain fishes, especially in the Twisted Strand area, it was so painful. And lastly, I want to shout out the best rod there is, a versatile rod. With this, I don't need to keep chains in the rods and it's very useful with an oceanic net combined to it. This was a bit different video from my usual content, but I really enjoyed Dredge and wanted to share some tips, tricks and hacks for it. Please continue to support small creators like the amazing developers of this game and small creators like me for example by liking, commenting and subscribing to my channel. Thank you, Ram out.